smoked. Look at that deer. I don't think I'll ever top this. It just don't get no better. Look at that, guys. Well, hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Jeff Danker here, and welcome to this week's Two Minute Tuesday Start the Clock. All right, guys, one thing uh, I wanted to just talk to you a little bit about is your taxidermy. Um, many of you guys know what you want, but I've had a lot of questions that you don't know what you want. And, and basically what I'm gonna tell you that I do on pretty much every deer, unless I'm doing something special, is what they call a semi-sneak. Uh, you may not know what that is, and that's what every one of these deer poses is. It's, you know, sometimes you think that's a big sneak, but it's just more down, it's not the upright, okay? So these are semi-sneaks. I pretty much use a semi-sneak on everything. And the other big thing that I would tell you is what I like to do is have your taxidermy follow the antlers with the ears. As you can see, um, pretty much every one of these are following the antlers. And, and again, so you don't have uh, a, a, you know, a ears up like this, and if you have the ears up, it takes away from the rack. Um, so that's something, and again, you always have your deal where you're gonna get an aggressive mount or something like that. And I'm not talking about that, but I'm talking about your best, just average looking deal. Semi-sneak and make sure that those ears follow the antlers. And I promise you, uh, your mount will look a lot better usually. So, so again, I hope that helps you. Um, until next time, we'll see you in the next one.